All right. All right. So can you please introduce yourself and what do you do? Sure. Uh, my name is Noah Samuels. I am Deputy Director and Paralegal with the Northwest Consumer Law Center here in Seattle. Uh, essentially, it's a small nonprofit law firm that helps out low in and moderate income families with consumer financial legal issues like mortgage foreclosure, bankruptcy, debt collection, student loans, and auto fraud. And uh, we also do a, a lot of education and outreach to communities as well as to uh, empower consumers with the knowledge and resources to protect their rights. Very cool. So it sounds like the legal area that you are an expert in is very similar to um, the theme of this game jam. What do you think about this game jam um, taking on that theme? I think it's great. Um, there was just a, a study released in Washington called this, uh, the 2015 legal, Civil Legal Needs Study Update uh, that studied the <clears throat> legal problems most faced by low-income communities across Washington State. And the huge difference that they noticed between this study and the study that they did about 12 years ago was that consumer has jumped to basically the top of the list, just under healthcare. So it is an incredibly prevalent problem among people who need legal help but cannot afford it. So I think the time is right now to just rally our resources around um, focusing, I mean, you know, rallying our resources around giving consumer legal help to people, you know, and this game jam is a great way to do it because uh, technology is... I would say where it's at now with legal services um, because people have smartphones and people have access to computers more than they used to, uh, even low income people to a degree, you know. And also because there's always this challenge of not enough physical human beings who are lawyers or even paralegals or, or whatever to give legal assistance to people. We need some kind of way to augment that. And what better way to do that than through technology like smartphone apps or websites or things like that, games. You know? Cool. Um, what are some of like the common pitfalls that you that you see over and over again when working with consumer affairs? Um, well, there's, I think the, a pitfall. I mean, could you define your question a little more? I mean, I guess um, you know what is something I guess that is a major problem that you just see over and over that you know the everyday person might not notice and might accidentally stumble into. Mm, that's a good question. Um, I think a, a one major problem is uh, medical debt is a huge issue. Uh, people, you know, we're in America where we don't have the kind of health care that can cover everybody. So people incur medical debt. And there's a program in Washington state called Charity Care, where if you are low income or even moderate income, you can either get your medical bill paid for by the hospital or at least a, a, a discount on it, right? And a pitfall is people don't know about that. Hospitals don't let people know. So they rock, they rack up this debt. They get sued for it. They could go. They could have charity care to wipe it out and not be sued, right? Not go to court, not get a judgment against them. But they don't know. Nobody told them, you know. So that's a big pitfall. So uh, I guess my message to consumers out there would be: if you have medical debt, look into charity care. And that's only for Washington State, right? Okay. Other states may have it, but my my organization focuses on. Washington State. So that's kind of all I know. Very cool. Yeah. Um, and I guess one last question to wrap it up. What do you think about these people trying to make like the, the legal advice or uh, trying to teach people about legal issues, especially when it comes to like low income, mm -hmm. into interactive video games? I think it's totally cool. I think it's awesome. Um, it's, a, it's an avenue that... Uh, it's a diff it's fresh. It's a different avenue. It's um, you know, when people think of law, what do they think of? Like the big cement pillars in front of a courthouse and stodgy old white men with white wigs on. Guilty, Your Honor, right? Instead of like, wow, I can go on my phone and find out my legal rights and maybe stop myself from getting in huge trouble when I don't have to because I know something. So I love it. I think this is totally cool that like all these young hip people are all you know kind of getting involved in this. I think it's awesome. So. Awesome. Thank you very much for your time, Noah. You're welcome. <laughs>